I'm here with Susan Riley of the American Irish Repertory Ensemble, who is working in collaboration with the Maine Irish Heritage Center to put together a celebration for Bloomsday. And uh, to begin with, what is Bloomsday? Well, Bloomsday is June 16th, and it's the day um, on which James Joyce's epic novel Ulysses takes place. And ever since the 1950s, there's been this tradition of holding celebrations on Bloomsday to celebrate Joyce and Ulysses and Irish culture. And cities in over 40 countries around the world are now holding celebrations. So this year, we're going to have one in Portland. And uh, what's, what's involved with it? What, what, what's the, what are the dates for it? First? Well, first of all, there's going to be two main events. One is on Tuesday, June 15th at 7.30. And my theater company, Air, is going to perform an original piece called Ulysses for Beginners, which is a very funny one-hour recapitulation of the plot of Ulysses using songs, stories, slides, and a lot of humor so that people who have no idea what's going on in Ulysses can watch this, and it's like Cliff's Notes. It's mm -hmm. a, and it's a very funny Cliff's Notes, and it's set in a pub. It's at Bullfini's upstairs, so you can't miss having a good time. And then the next day, which is Wednesday, June 16th, we're doing an event at the Maine Irish Heritage Center, and uh, that's on Gray Street here in Portland. And we're going to be going from 5 o'clock to 8.30, and we're going to have readings from Ulysses. That's the core of a Bloomsday celebration is the readings. So we're going to have short segments of all 18 of the chapters of Ulysses read by um, wordsmiths. We got writers, poets, actors, uh, broadcast personalities, uh, we, have, uh, we have Pat Callahan of Channel 6, Chuck Igo of Y100. We got Megan Grumbling, who's um, a wonderful poet and theater critic of the um, uh, Portland Phoenix. We have Nate Amadon, who is a poet and the leader of Port Veritas, which does the slams at the North Star uh, Cafe. We have three professors from USM. We've now, got are they all Irish? Not all of them. <laughs> <laughs> Bloomsday transcends nationality. <laughs> it's a great way to celebrate Irish culture, but you don't have to be Irish to be part of it. And at the Maine Irish Heritage Center event, we're also going to have musicians uh, who are going to be doing traditional music, as well as music of Joyce's day and music that's referenced in Ulysses. And we'll have refreshments. And um, because it's an Irish party, it's going to be a lot of fun all around. And one thing I'd also like to mention is, as far as other partners in Bloomsday, um, Longfellow Books, uh, right here in Monument Square, is uh, giving a discount of 20% on any books written by James Joyce during the month of June, which is very generous. And the um, Irish American Club of Maine has also donated an Irish cultural grant to help support the event. So this is really a community event a that we hope... A big collaboration. Will, a very big collaboration that we're hoping will kind of get established and people will have a great time and we'll be able to do even more fun things in the future. Now if people want to get more information is there a website they can go to or a phone number or anything? They can go to our website www.airtheater.com and uh, the Irish uh, Maine Irish Heritage Center website I believe is maineirish.org. Okay. Well great. Well thank you for being here to tell us about it and thank I know you. it sounds like a great event. I, I think I'd like to go to it. <laughs> we'll be forward to seeing you. Thank right. you. Back to you, Leslie.